there are two different types of medical schools, lecture-based versus PBL, which is problem-based learning. And a lot of the lectures take place in small groups. So it's really important to find out when you apply which of the two works best. But Bristol was a lecture-based one. So they're actually different at different places? Yeah. So um, PBL is really interesting. And I actually think that that might be the better way to learn. But they choose a particular problem. And then it's all small group seminars. But it's quite hard if you're not the type of learner where you can just sit and absorb information coming at you in lecture based and make notes. And there were many, I, I just happened to be the type of person who could do that really well, but I didn't know that until I was doing it and watching my colleagues not do as well. So I learned that I was the type of person who can listen to a lecture, a lecturer speak for an hour. I can take notes and those notes are relevant to me tomorrow. But other people found that they weren't like that at all. And what obviously happens is people stop coming to lectures. Like they just start staying home. They just start borrowing their mates notes, making notes off their mates notes. And it's because they've not paid attention to the type of learner that they are at that point. So I think if, you know, choosing medicine, you have to be the type of person who can listen to large streams of information, turn them into notes that seem relevant and then be able to basically memorize a load of stuff it's a lot of like memory and recall as a as a doctor in training it's a lot of memory and recall interesting okay yeah because that's not how i learned very well no <laughs> um not to say though that you couldn't learn to learn that way because that's yeah. what what it's about it's about teaching you to adopt that learning style but, um, and there are various hacks, you know, into how do I learn to learn better in that scenario if you're not naturally like that. But you might find that you don't pass the exams straight away when, if you're not that type of learner, because you haven't yet learned to learn in the way that medical school is asking you to. So it's just being aware that your learning style will impact things because medicine hasn't changed its learning style for millennia. I mean, you have to learn that the heart has four pumps and it and it and it works like this. There's no way around the fact that there are scientific facts that you need to memorize and be able to regurgitate um, because that's the nature of the discipline. But how you do that is up to you. And that's the part that you need to, to be open to that there might not be in the conventional way. Yeah. Nicely put. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs>